Yo, what is going on, YouTube? I am so freaking excited. I got a box right here from smkw.com, and I have two of the Rough Rider Reserve lines in here, and we are going to check them out right now. I've been waiting so long for these knives, and I am so excited. I'm so excited. I've heard such good things about them. Now, I live in Ohio, so I haven't got them as, uh, as quick as some. But they're here, and we're not going to worry about that. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah, baby. So I have two of the three, and I'm waiting on the third one to be shipped. So when that third one comes in, I will review it also look at that oh now i don't know which one is which i'm assuming this one is the heavier one so this one's the coke bottle whittler and this is the one-armed razor single blade so we are going to open this one up first oh baby oh i can't wait look at that look at that oh it's so nice oh my gosh Built by hand, backed for life. That is a very, very nice metal cylinder right there. Let's pop her open. Oh, new knife smell. Yeah, baby. Has a wonderful foam packing in there. That is super great. Look at that. Ooh, fancy. Fancy. And moment of truth. Wow. So, we have a little chamois cloth with a rubber band on there. Pardon the fingernails. I chew my fingernails. I work a very stressful job. The moment of truth. Oh. <laughs> so, scrapped in paper with a, with a cloth. And I... Oh. This... Bro, look at that. First of all, it is way bigger than I expected. I was not expecting it to be as big as it is, but I'm very happy. It, like, it's a normal size knife. Don't get me wrong. I don't know what I was expecting. Oh. Look, look at that. Look how perfect that is. Oh my God. Let's open her up. Moment of truth. Ooh. Hear that snappiness? Yeah, baby. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Denim micarta, easy open, brass tube, lanyard, brass liners. Look at that. You can't get any more perfect than that right there. You cannot get any more perfect than that right there. I'm calling it. Mm -hmm. Wow. Look how clean it is on the inside. Just a freaking beauty. Right there, RRR01. Let's focus, focus on the camera. We're gonna focus right here. Oh, oh, there we go. Oh, boop. There we go. That's not, that wasn't very good. Look, right there. RRR. Oh, one, that sweet swedge. Oh, man. I like an easy open. I like a one arm open right there. The one arm open with the easy pull. You can pull it, pinch it, pull it. Oh, so smooth like butter. Just listen to it. It's about a six, seven, 
I would put it right in between. I'm going to tell you right now, this one has a better walk and talk than my GEC Dixie Stockman. I'm going to tell you that. That's for sure. But for most Stockmans, or for most GECs, most Stockmans, oh my goodness. I'm so excited I'm stumbling over my words. Uh, it's about a six. Six for a pool. The snap is beautiful. The, I mean, the walk and talk is really, honestly, right down the middle. Just great. Look at that. That nice swedge right there. Just D2 steel. Knocked it out of the park. Of course, we got to do a gap check. Zero gapping. Just absolute zero gapping. Inlaid arrowhead shield. No, absolutely no predominant pins. Just smooth like butter. Like butter, baby. Yeah. Oh, man. Let's open the other one. Let's open the other one. This one is the one-arm easy open razor right there. Look at that. In denim micarta. That denim micarta is very nice. I like that a lot. Look at that. Look at that. Look at the blade centering. I mean, you can't get any more dead nuts. You can't get any more dead nuts. Bye, Case. Bye-bye. You are officially dead. You are dead when these come out. This is only $39.99. $39.99. Just, dude, are you serious? I don't, I, this might be $29.99 if I, if I think so right. $29.99, maybe $30 in that range. Look at that. Holy crap. All right, let's open up the other one. <laughs> it's like Christmas morning. I've been waiting so long for these. So long. I can't wait. Ah, oh, a new knife. Oh, so good. Yeah, bro. This. Ooh, buddy. Oh, hey, birdie. You almost flew in my window. <laughs> I'm just so... <laughs> oh, man. Comes with a chamois cloth. Ready? Dudes! Are you freaking kidding me? Hi. There's a there's literally a bird right on my hood, like landed on my window. Oh my god. Look at that. Look at that. This is the first time I'm seeing them, and it's the first time you guys are seeing them also. Let's hear the main blade. Let's hear the walk. And the, look how unbelievable clean that is. Just Ah! Beautiful. The the fit and finish is incredible. Look at that. Just incredible. There's a little bit of hair right there. We ain't worried about that. It's just fuzz. Look. Oh my goodness. Let's open her up. Oh. <laughs> Great half stop. Yeah. That's oh yeah. That is, this is, that's the perfect one. Oh, goosebumps, baby. Goosebumps. That is the most perfect walk and talk. Oh, look at, this might be the only knife I ever carry ever again. The ergos on this is just insane. It is big. It has this beautiful swedge. Matt Strike Bolsters. Look at that big belly. Oh, baby. Yeah. Oh, are you kidding? I got to do it again. Oh, look at that centering. Zero blade rub. Zero blade rub on that centering right there. Why? Let's just listen to it again. Shh. Oh, oh baby. 
baby. Yeah. Oh, man, that is fucking crazy. Oh, I just cussed. Oh, sorry. Oh, dude. Holy smoke. Oh, let me wipe this off this blade. I'm getting my, my fingers all gross. Honestly, like, so I'm waiting for the kayak to come in. And I was really, really excited about the one arm razor. And I was very curious about this. But this might be my jam. This might be my jam. I'm very excited about the kayak. But this right here is... If you're going to buy one of these, this might be it. That black micarta. Let's open up the other blades here. Whew, I'm getting warm. I'm literally sweating. I'm so worked up. Just a beautiful all blade. Let's look at that. See if we can open up the other one. I have very short fingernails, so it doesn't, I, I would assume anybody with an appropriate length fingernail wouldn't have trouble as I have trouble opening a, a traditional pocket knife. And the other reason why I have short fingernails is because I work a very stressful job. So that's where we're at with that. And I, I've reiterated that. I chew my fingernails. It's a bad habit. I don't like it, but here we are. There we go. Bam. Oh, yeah. Look how gorgeous. Just that Coke bottle right there. Look how gorgeous this knife is. Nobody's doing this. No traditional knife company is doing this. This design's from the 1800s. Nobody revitalized it. Nobody put it in production. Smoky Mountain Knife or, or Smoky Mountain Knife Works did. Rough Rider did. And they did it so beautifully. D2 steel. I mean, come on, guys. I know a lot of people were complaining about the price. You are getting more than what these knives are worth. Absolutely. These are GEC quality all day long. And I might take some flack for that. I don't care. These are absolutely GEC quality. Look how clean that is. Look at the fit and finish of this. I would put these up against any production knife you have, and I guarantee you, if you didn't know the name of Rough Rider, you wouldn't care. You would be blown away if there was no tank stamp, if there was no D2 number on there. You would be blown away by this knife. Absolutely blown away. Look at that long, that long secondary blade right there. You got that all blade right there, that nice little tanto. I am in absolute love. Absolute love with this. Look. Just gorgeous. I didn't, to be honest, I feel like I did the other knife a disservice. Because I didn't spend enough time on it. These right. <laughs> oh my goodness. Rough Rider, you never cease to amaze me. Look at that. You can buy both of these. Both of these less. Less than a hundred bucks. Less than 90 bucks, to be honest. Look at that. You cannot go wrong. I cannot freaking wait for my kayak to come in. I can't wait for the kayak to come in. I am so freaking excited. This might be my EDC for the rest of my life. We'll see where the kayak takes me, but I am in love with this one. This one is my life right now. And I could not be happier about it. Holy crap. That's my review on two of the three Rough Rider Reserve lines. I can't wait till the third one comes in. If you guys take a risk on this, take a chance on these, I swear you are going to love them. SMKW.com. 
I do not plan or I do not see these being around for very much longer. These are going to sell out quick. And Andy from smkw.com has shared the bar back, which is part of the Rough Rider Reserve line. And that knife, I swear, is specifically designed for me. It has to be. You cannot convince me otherwise. But other than that, don't forget to like, subscribe, tell a friend. Let me know what you guys think about the reserve line right here. The Rough Rider reserve line. Please, Rough Rider, keep doing what you're doing. Keep producing these because I, I honestly... I think I'm going to just start saving my nickels and waiting for these to come out because these are absolute just diamond. Just, just, just to quote Nick Shabazz, these are freaking gems. And I am just, I could not be happier about them. So there you are. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know if you guys have one and what you think of it. And don't forget to like and subscribe and tell a buddy. Thank you for watching. I'm going to go play with my new knives now. Have a good day. Bye.